hi guys and welcome back to my youtube channel in today's video i'm going to be showing you guys how you can remove remini watermark or remini logo from your ai generated photos the reason why i'm making this video is because so many persons have been asking me on how they can actually remove the remini watermark from their ai photos that's the reason why i'm making this video and i believe as many that have asked me that particular question they will be able to see this video and they will be able to get value from this normally on the remini app when you generate ai photos of yourself using the app you're going to find out that the watermark or the logo of remini is normally at the base of the photo that you generated the ai photos that you generate using the remini app normally has the watermark at the base you're going to see the remini watermark at the base of the AI picture. Let me show you guys what I mean. Let me show you guys a few examples. Um, you can see this AI photo I generated using this Remini app. You're going to see that it has the Remini watermark at the base of the photo. You can see there. Let me zoom in a little bit. You can see. So let me show you the next photo. You can see this AI photo as well. It also has the Remini watermark. Let me go to the next photo. You can see. So guys, any photo that you actually generate using Remini app is going to have the logo. But in this video today, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can remove that watermark in just few seconds. So guys, if you want to know how to remove the Remini watermark or the Remini logo from your AI photos that you generate from Remini app, just make sure you follow me to the end of this video to get it all. And also, if you're new to our YouTube channel, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave a comment as that will tremendously help grow our YouTube channel. So guys, without any further ado, let's get started. The first step to take is to tap on your browser to open it. Whichever browser you're using, be it Opera Mini, Phonix, Chrome, just tap on it to open it. Let me tap on my Chrome browser. I'm using Chrome for this tutorial today. So let me tap on my Chrome. So guys, once you open up your browser, what you have to search for is watermarkremover.io. You can see it there on the screen. So let me search for it. Watermarkremover.io. Then you tap on enter. So guys, once you search for watermarkremover.io, this is where it's going to bring it to. As you can see, this is what the interface looks like. You can see what is written there. Remove watermarks from your images for free. Get rid of watermarks from your images using powerful AI technology. So guys, the first step that you have to take here now is to tap on where it is written upload image. You can see it there, the arrow is pointing at it. So let me tap on it. So guys, you can see now it has brought us to our gallery. What you have to do now is to choose the image that you want to remove the watermark from. Let me choose this image here. You can see the AI image. Let me tap on it. You can see where the arrow is pointing at. Let me tap on it. So guys, once you choose the image, what you have to do is to tap on done. You can see where the arrow is pointing at it. You can see it at the top. So let me tap on done. So guys, as you can see, it is uploading our image. Let's just wait for some minutes. So guys, as you can see, it's processing our image. Look at what is written there. Processing image. Please wait. Let's just wait for a few seconds. So guys, as you can see, it is done processing. You can see at the top there, we have the original image. While down here, we have the watermark removed. So guys, under the watermark removed image, you can see down there, we have two options. Look at where the arrow is pointing at. We have the first one, remove text. You can see where the arrow is pointing at it. And the second one, remove logo. You can see the arrow is pointing at it. So from this image now, if you actually want to remove all the text that is in the image, what you have to do is to tap on the first option. You can see where the arrow is pointing at. What you have to do is to tap on the on option. Once you tap on the on option, all the text around the picture will be removed. And as you know, Remini watermark is actually a text. It is written Remini, then under the Remini, it is written AI generated photo. So guys, for you to remove that Remini watermark, all you have to do now is to tap on on. So guys, over to the second one, you can see the arrow pointing at it. Remove logo. For you to actually remove the logo, all you have to do is to tap on the on option. Once you tap on the on option, the Remini logo will be removed. The Remini watermark is in the form of text. So whichever option you choose between the two, whether the first one remove text or the second one remove logo, whichever one you toggled on, the Remini watermark will be removed. So let me use the first one, which is remove text. Once I tap on remove text now, it is going to process to remove the Remini logo. So let me tap on it so you see what I'm saying. So guys, as you can see, they're processing image. So let's just wait for a few seconds. Then the Remini text will be removed. Wow, guys, you can see it is done processing. So let's go over to the watermark removed image. So guys, now you can see now under the watermark removed image, you can no longer find the Remini watermark again. You can see the one at the top. This is the one, the original one. You can see the watermark down there. You can see the arrow pointing at it. But if you scroll downward over to the watermark removed image, you're going to find out that the Remini watermark, the Remini logo has been removed. You can see it. You can compare it. This is the one at the top. This is the one below. So we no longer have the Remini watermark in the lower one, which is awesome. So guys, also for the remove logo, you can also toggle it on if you want to. But as you can see here, the Remini logo has been removed. But in case you have any watermark or logo that is not in the text format, you can go ahead to tap the second one. But let me go ahead to tap on it so that you see what I'm saying. Let me tap on it. So guys, as you can see now, it's processing. Let's just wait for a few seconds. 
wow guys you can see it's done processing so let's scroll downwards to see the watermark removed image so guys you can see now the watermark has been removed i've toggled on the remove text you can see the arrow pointing at it and also the remove logo you can see the arrow pointing at it i've toggled both of them on and as you can see here in the image now, you can no longer find the Remini watermark or the Remini logo. Let's compare it with the original one which has the watermark. So let's scroll downwards. So guys, you can see here, this is the original one. We have the watermark on it. You can see the arrow pointing at it. But over here at the watermark removed section, there is no watermark. You can see both of them. You can see the arrow pointing on both of the images. You can see the difference and it's clear. So guys, there's something I want you to take note of. This Remini watermark is in the text format. Like it is actually written Remini. R-E-M-I-N-I. -I. That means it's spelled out. That's the logo. That's the watermark. What that means is that you can actually use just the first option which is remove text. Since the Remini watermark is in the text format. So you don't have to use the second one at all. But if you don't want to use the first option which is remove text, you can decide to use the second option which is remove logo. Whichever one you use will work for you perfectly. And in case you're trying to use the watermark of any application of any app that has no text in it, the right one to use is the second one which is remove logo. Once you toggle it on, the watermark will be removed. So guys, the next step now to take now is to tap on where it is written, download image. You can see there, once you tap on it now, the image without the watermark will be downloaded directly into your gallery. So let me tap on it. So guys can see at the top downloading file our file is downloading in a few seconds now it's going to be fully downloaded then once it's fully downloaded i'll go to my gallery now to show you guys so guys can see now file downloaded you can see that at the top you can see the arrow pointing at it the file has been downloaded so let me go back to my gallery right away let me minimize then let me tap on my gallery then let me go back to my downloads let me tap on my downloads then you can see there that's the first picture so let me tap on it Wow guys, you can see now we have no watermark on this AI generated photos. You can see this is so awesome. So guys, you can see now at the base, there is no Remini watermark, no Remini logo, no trace of it. This is actually amazing. So guys, let me show you the original picture. Let me show you the original picture. Let me go over to my picture section. Very fast. Very fast. Let me tap on it. Then let me tap on the image right away. So guys, you can see the original image. It has the Remini generated AI on it. You can see it. So guys can see this is so awesome and I've come to the end of this video and I believe you've got value from this. If you did make sure you like, subscribe and leave a comment. And also if you're new to our YouTube channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell notification. So that whenever I release a new video, you're gonna get notified. See you in our next upload. Bye bye. Peace.